What's up, you two? It's the J Man and me, the jokester. Uh, and today we're gonna react to some weird commercials. So, the first one. For quiz. Well, I don't. I don't know. I don't think the first one is the Quiznos ad. Let's just. Mama put together this playlist for us of weird commercials. We don't really know what's on it. We, th we think there's a Quiznos commercial. Let's just hit play and see what comes up. All right, here we go. I'm hitting play now. Get more sleep without count sheep and have another night of bliss. Oh, look at this guy go. The bus barn in, Wasilla, now is where we is. in Anchorage. This Save is Alaska. This guy's in Alaska. Well, that's fun. Short and fun. Man, I might just chill tonight. Puppy monkey baby. 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 I think it's supposed to be a like it's a combination of a monkey and a pug and a baby. Uh, obviously not real. Not a real creature. We love these hogs! Here we go. This is a classic. Quiznos. You like those things? What? We open on a family eating dinner at a table. The dinner consists of moon pies and a couple of waters. Parent, I love moon pies. They're very good, but I wish for more. Well, we have something to show you. What is it? We have found you a new sibling. Nice. Oh my god. Yes! Oh my goodness. This is a joyous time. The parents guide the children into the living room. A beautiful moon pie child walks out from the shadows. The perfect blend of snack and human. A you beautiful moon pie child. Pants, even though it is. We, we love it! <laughs> they all embrace the moon pie child and everyone cries in a good way. It's your call. You can enjoy the fresh baked quality from Domino's Pizza or take your chances. With oh my god, it's pizza. annoying. You can have pizza made to your Those pizzas. Or... <laughs> you can count on our famous 30 minute delivery or. You can taste the quality from Domino's Pizza, so avoid the noid. <laughs> Domino's Pizza delivers. Call now, now. Can your fruit snack do this? <laughs> oh, gross! They can say bring a little banana. It's the blast in That's disgusting. This is too disturbing. With a mega burst of fruity juice. If your fruit snack can't do this, it's not a blast. Cusher's fruit snack yeah. will blow you away. There once was a town that worked so hard, there was just no time for play. But that all changed on this one particular day. No, the bat it's the camera's plugged in. And you're missing this dancing guy. This old guy's dancing. You love to dance. And you love old people.
there's a time for work, and there's a time for play. Six Flags, it's playtime. Well, how does this mask do that? Well, if you can get the idea of what doing eight setups a second would do for your stomach, you have an idea of what Rejuvenic would do for your face. Because in essence, Rejuvenic does for the face what exercise does for the body. And the way it does that is there's a control unit that during a facial session actually sends an impulse up to the zones in the mask and actually activates the face and skin to exercise, tighten, and tone. So we like to say that's a lot of face ups. This is doing it eight times a second. During a facial toning session, the system delivers a mild impulse generated by a tiny 9-volt battery. That mask, yeah, you want to wear a special mask that'll send little jolts of electricity to your face. facial cushions of the patented facial mask and actually activate the face and skin to exercise, tighten, and tone through each of the 12 facial zones. Well, you know, you don't need to start in the forehead facial, facial zone and about every 20 seconds automatically move one zone at a time through each of the 12 facial zones. These zones are specifically designed to handle the major problem areas of the face. The system automatically repeats this process a total of four times during your 15-minute facial workout. The result is not only a more toned, youthful-looking face, but also a face that looks and feels fresher, more vibrant with that healthy, rosy glow. You always have a healthy, rosy glow, Jason. You don't need that mask. That baby's flying the <laughs> That child is growing up as it orbits the Earth. Kinder, you shaky. Me on Scrabbly. Chocka Doobie, Doobie Chocka Doobie, Pop Swabble, <laughs> Toy, Yodel Yum and Choco Scrum with multi Pop Swabble guys. Oh, Grubbly. <laughs> Me Scrubble now. Snuggle. Whee. And a surprise from Ferrero. <laughs> I'm Dee Dumbly. I bet you didn't know he was a real guy. There's good reason for my glistening skin and how I shine and how my pores are so clean and clear. I eat little baby's ice cream. It keeps me young. It keeps me light on my feet. I spring from activity to activity. I love my job. I love my life. When you eat little baby's ice cream, you'll wink and nod and hug and high-five each other with great enthusiasm. This is a special time. This is another commercial baby's that ice I, don't, cream. I don't think this is real. I think ice cream is a I think feeling. Is made up. I think it's a joke commercial. I don't think it's real. This and that human child doll commercial. I'm not buying it. Well, there was some weird stuff in those commercials, Jay. What, what, what do you think was the best commercial out of all those that we just watched? What doing, guys? Well, they, yeah, they can let us know. The viewers can let us know in the comments. I'm asking you right now. I think your favorite was the baby that got shot out of that lady and flew around the world and grew up. Huh. 
Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty good one. Xbox. Yeah. It was a very creative Xbox ad. But you you know, you all you I think the only no, you'd only seen the Quiznos commercial before, right? You like that Quiznos. Quiznos Weird little, little people I remember when those first came came out, people hated them. Because they were weird and annoying. Um I've failed for I Chicken. Do you thought <laughs> you thought those weird Quiznos things were fried chicken? Yeah. Yeah, they do kind of look like chicken. They're sort of weird looking. Um, and you oh, you had seen the Gushers commercial before because I I know you've seen the Gushers commercial before because sometimes before I give you a piece of fruit, you'll say, "Is this going to turn my head into an apple, or is this going to turn my head into a banana?" So. Um, you know, what ad, which ad do you think was the creepiest? What do you think was the creepiest? The the little baby's ice cream, or the Humpty Dumpty guy? It's gross and you for your thousand eyes. Yeah, that's kind of gross. I don't know. They were all all pretty weird and pretty wild. And but I like the mat. I like mattress ranch. I like to see that guy dancing. And it was short. Well, we got to thank Mama for curating all these commercials. Definitely some wacky, weird stuff. And, uh, you know, let us know in the comments if you think one particular commercial was the weirdest or uh, freaked you out or did not, or were none of them weird. Who knows? Maybe people didn't think these commercials were too weird at all. You know, <clears throat> maybe they're pretty tame where you come from. But, J-Man, I enjoyed watching these commercials with you. And <laughs> yeah. Cooper and Bowser too. So it's become a great success. <laughs> well, you're absolutely right, Jason. The, the television show that you've been writing, the Koopalings and Bowser Jr. show that uh, has not been made yet in any way that has only been written down by you in the computer has been a wild success uh, in the family when we read the episodes to everyone and we can't wait to uh, start producing those episodes as soon as Nintendo promises not to sue us for stealing their intellectual property and we'll let you know when that's happening but it's a very creative fun series by the J-Man about the Kooplings and Bowser Jr. before they were evil and fighting Mario. We're gonna, we gotta go now because we gotta uh, glue these glasses to your head because you keep taking them off all day and night. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Puppy. Monkey. Baby. <laughs>